This is the name of the company that makes this product. It is their Porta Potty, and this is the model number. It has an electric pump, and here you can see a picture of it. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. Let's look at it from this side. It's a side view. This is the fresh water tank here, and this is the black water tank here, where or the wastewater tank, uh, clean water, wastewater. And here, this is like a little portable funnel, and it'll fit right here. This is where, right in there, is where you fill in your fresh water. And if you use this, it's easier to pour it in without it splashing all over the place. So it's, you can just stick it there. I guess you can stick like that, but that looks like the best way to, to keep that with the with the toilet so you don't lose it. Um, this is a handle after you have separated the bottom from the top to carry it to take it to where you want to dump it. This is a release button that separates the two. Um, this also is a handle for carrying this too, so you can carry these both separately. Um, so let's go over to this side. On this side, this is a lever, it's the flush level, so when you pull it all the way to here, it opens up the bottom and the waste goes in down here. So it opens it up and it goes down. Here, this is actually pretty handy. This is an area where you can put your little toilet paper, uh, whatever you use. So this area here has a lock on it, so it doesn't like flap around. So you unlock it, you lift it up. And then you have the seat, which also lifts up as well. Here is a overhead view of it. Um, pretty nice, simple design. Here you have uh, the little logo. It's the name of the company here. And you also in the back have this flap that comes up. And here, this little thing that went in the back there. This is where you fill the water in without it splashing. The funnel helps. And in this, that's how you flush it. It's battery operated. Um, and I believe this is like a gauge to let you know how much. Um, I'm not sure. I haven't looked at the directions. That it's either fresh water or it's letting you know if, if the bottom tank's full. Um, it may be both. Um, uh, so anyway, you, when, you're, when you're done filling up your water, you go ahead and stick this down. You close the flap, and in this, this here goes in the back so that you do not lose, uh, lose it. Now, uh, this is the top. Pretty nice, simple look, and again, it latches here. You can see it goes, snaps into place. Unlock it, pull it up. Um, I like that it has a really big deep bowl. Um, I already have some water in the bottom here. So if we zoom in, you can see that there's water down here. Right down here, there's water. And let's go back. Okay, so now we are going to um, try this out. I think it's kind of a good idea to have a little bit of water already in this so that whatever you have that you got to do is going to flush down a little better if there's already some water in it. So, since we're going to start with doing uh, the number one, then you don't need as much water as you do on the second one. So we're going to put some of the number one in. There we go. And if you're a woman, then you're going to need some toilet paper. So there you go. And let's see how well it flushes. Well, actually, we have the water in there, so we're going to have to hit the flush button on this side. Flush that down, and then let's add a little water to it. We're going to now go with number two, which actually, <laughs> this is uh, beans that I, some of the beans are solid, and some of them I put in the blender, so you have kind of a combo. So you gotta go here in number two. And I don't know. It kind of looks like diarrhea to me. <laughs> this is <laughs> it's a messy one. Okay. Alright. 
So, how are we going to be able to get all this? Let's see. Um, see if I can try and knock some of it off. And then empty. Now I'm not sure if it's because I'm using be the beans that they're kind of sticking here. Let's try that again. I'm not told if it's not wanting to go down. You can see like right there. This side's good, but it starts getting over to this side. It's like, wow, well, okay, it's all gone. Okay, so let's close it up. When you are ready to empty the bottom waste tank, you take this, do that, that lifts that up. And then this is a handle that you can carry it to wherever you want to take it to empty it. So you pick it up like that. And carry it to wherever you want to go. I have already cleaned this out so the only thing that's in here is just water but I'm just going to show you that once you get to where you're going to dump it which is usually either a camp dumping station or a toilet then this moves around and that's like the good spot although it can move like that this is the position it is in when it's when it's on the tops on it but you can position this that way or that way whatever is the easiest for you to pour then you take this top thing here and then this is say this is a toilet then flip it and then it pours out like that like so okay um, and then you, then once it's done, then you put it like that, and we bring it back to the other piece. So now it's back next to the other piece. Just make sure that this is facing like that. Then you sit it on, and you can hear it snap into place, and you can see that it's on. So. That's pretty much it.